Okay, this rough cut video is an attempt to answer the first question in this post. In one embed, we've embedded the group below a news article in our intranet, and I can't backspace to remove that group to post in another group. Is that typical? I recall in the past being able to backspace, remove the group, and add an alternate group. Now, first off, I would say that isn't typical. You should be able to backspace to remove that group and post in another one. And I should use a quick demo to see what, show you what I mean. Uh, for the demo, I just have a little bit of code, which is uh, on the screen now. And within the code, you can see the default group ID is set. So when the code is rendered on a typical internet page and a new comment is set, you get the default group popping up. Now you hit the cross, that should remove the group and you should be able to pick a new one. And then you can uh, add your comments and hit post. Nothing original there. So you can see on this page, we have comments going to the talk on Yama Sandpit group, as well as uh, earlier comments, which is going to another group. Now, returning back to the original question, the remover group and add an alternate group only works for the initial post. As you saw when I made my initial post, the group was there and available and you can hit cross and I could remove it. If I were to reply to one of these sets of comments, these comments will be posted in the, the original group selected. So in this case, is the talk on Yama Sandpit. Notice I only have the option to pick additional people. And similarly, if I went down to this one near the bottom, maybe with a bit of a refresh to make sure it fits in the page. You see here, any comments I post here, will be going to the Yama demo feed group. Again, if I pull this down and go to pick new people, I don't have groups. If I wanted to pick the other group, you can see that Yama does not offer me a group. So hopefully that shows the difference between replying to comments and initiating a new one. 